Hello everyone, my name is Anonymous Pepper 2012 and this is the first computer video of the new month. Here's to hoping May is going to be just as great as March. Here we have yet another distinct location, located beneath the Pink Floyd poster and right next to the Logan Whitehurst in the Junior Science Club poster. And we find ourselves with a world-famous ThinkPad T420. We gather here today um, because I hope to remedy a highly specific issue that only exists because I'm stubborn and because I'm stupid. So, this computer right now, and I intend to keep it this way, it's running Windows 7. And unless I switch to Linux, it's staying on Windows 7. Um, but this isn't the install that came with it. It's... Right now there's an SSD in here. Um, which has gone on quite the journey. Right, allow me to, to show what kind of journey it's gone on. So if we get spammed and out of the way... It can do this! Ooh. So I was, I was thinking that in order to keep my precious Steam games on my laptop, I'd have to stick with 32 shit Windows 7 until until I found out that uh, VXKEX, kind of like Kernel X for Windows 7, uh, got an update, and I was just I was just trying it out earlier today. And normally it doesn't do anything; it doesn't make anything work or before the update. It, it it didn't do jack shit for me. But today, I've gotten like five programs working with the XKEX. I was like, holy shit, it actually works now? Like, it's, it can do stuff? So I hit up the forums, and one dude said that he got Steam working, and just a couple games won't open, like Left 4 Dead 2. So I'm thinking, like, dude, reinstall Windows 7? <laughs> like, VX Kex and just try to get Steam? That's, that, that's, that's, that's what I'm gonna do. That's the point of the video. Yeah, after all that intro, it's finally time to start the video. <laughs> Who's ready for some Windows 7 installation action? <laughs> now, let me just fish out my media. You ready to do this bit again? I know I am. No, no. Fuck, dude. No, 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 wrong, no, no. Shame me, dude. Where is it? No, no. God. It's none of these. I have a mess to clean up. Here is, um, my legit Windows 7 disc. <laughs> I love holding my optical media like this. It's time to nuke the existing install and all of the cherished memories that are on it. Go, 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 go! No! Stop! Stop! Stop it! Think Vantage! Ah, oh, it's too late. Forgot to press the blue Think Vantage button to interrupt startup. Well, I guess this gives us the golden opportunity to... Opportunity? To see that it has a flickery screen? What? Uh, excuse me? Is there any way to remedy this? Uh, see, that's better. <laughs> this is already going terribly. Okay, whatever. Whatever, whatever. Let's look at our existing install. It's also fucked up in more ways than I've let on. Uh, it has no product key. Uh, as it reminds me every single time I log on. Ah. Beautiful. And it has a bunch of bloatware that I don't care about. I kind of, yeah, I kind of want to get rid of this install. Um, does, does it get any less flickery if I turn up the brightness? No. Yeah, I'll just need to reinstall Sony Vegas and FL Studio. Click team, and I've done that like a trillion times, dude. Aw, oh, dude! We got one week at Flumpties! Well, I guess it's time to nuke the install with the only copy of one week at Flumpties from the alternate universe. Where that exists. Bro thinks it's just a log off and shut down like the others, but bro literally doesn't know that bro. Ugh. This is bull shit. Oh, fuck. Whatever. Think Vantage. Is it still flickering? I don't freaking know, dude. 
Recover utility? What the fudge? Oh! Um, what the flip? Yeah. Uh, my first ever computer video was on Windows 7 installation. Since it wasn't on this channel, it was in the grand old year of 2018. <laughs> I remember it like it was yesterday. Wait a minute. What the freak? The exposure is so damn high that you actually can't see anything. So, um, auto, there, okay. Now you can read that it says Windows 7. Okay, let's install English. Next, install Windows Normal. <laughs> okay, Windows regular setup is starting. What about, since the setup is supposed to be 4x3, and the videos are 4x3, but if the camera records in widescreen, what if I just take the widescreen video from the camera and squish it down to 4x3 so that it looks normal? That'd be funny. We're gonna want to do X64 7 Ultimate. How nice of Microsoft to let us just do this. Yep. Uh -huh. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, I have to nuke it. No, I have to nuke it. No. No, format. Oh, no. I have to nuke it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, it's deleting them. Oh, no. No, why are you doing this? Why are you doing this? Stop! Stop! Stop deleting it! No, stop! Oh, oh no, it's making a new one! Oh no! What am I gonna do without my fucked up partitions? Oh, this really sucks. <laughs> this is stupid. Okay, uh, back to regular mode, please. Well, whilst this is installing, this laptop has an optical drive, which means we can listen to CDs and watch movies. Let's take a peek at some CDs we might be able to listen to. The fuck? Who gives a shit about Tally Hall? <laughs> I don't know a single- Who is Joe Bach Piano and Friends? Okay. <gasps> Logan Whitehurst, goodbye my four track? This looks just like my poster! The heavens really pulled through with this one. <laughs> oh my god, it's going so slow. It's going so slow. It's going so slowly. I'm gonna be an old man by the time it finishes. Uh, okay, Gamer Nation. I think it's time we do something on the side. Well, this game's it out. Are ye thinking me play the guitar? I hear that creep is a sad song. Let me play it. When you were here before. When you were here before. When you were here before, when you were here before, couldn't look you in the eye. Fuck, yeah. Let me try again. When you were here before, I messed up, sorry. Couldn't look you in the eye. You're just like an angel. Your skin makes me cry. But I'm a creep. I don't belong here. Thank you. Don't be done installing if you want an encore. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought, buddy. Yeah. As you can see, it's still going. Oh, it's not quite done yet. But uh, thanks to my musical skill. There, this was a Windows 7 disc and it was just sitting right here. Okay. Now, we're gonna have a slight issue when this thing is done. That's that. I almost tripped on my video kit. It's gonna have zero drivers or programs. Uh, but luckily, I have a good chunk of those on this here flash drive, which I believe has been featured in like 50% of all computer videos because it's just so useful and everything's on it. So, we're just gonna leave that right there. Waiting to be utilized. Oh boy! It's working! Type a username. Uh, that'll have to be my real legal name. 
get the password, okay. P A S S W O R D. Uh, it's not the word password. Okay, that should keep any hackers at bay and remind me of what the password is still. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Boy, oh boy, it's really gonna work. I can't help myself, I'll just... What the fuck is this shitty ass background, dude? That looks like garbage. <laughs> it's... Guess we're rocking the Lenovo leaves. <laughs> Ooh. Not the default startup sound? What fucking alternate universe did this install get shot out of? Whatever. Whatever, it's program time. Program's time. Fuck this sound, dude. Alright, personalize. Sounds. Default. Windows default. There. Okay. I'm gonna leave the Lenovo leaves though, because they're funny. Okay. Ooh, hazmat motel. Oh, it's probably in the driver folder. It's not in the driver's folder. Okay. Uh, frick yeah, we're gonna want all this shit. Oh! Um, I don't think we should have one of those folders on screen right now. Uh, like how in another video, I'm not gonna say which one, I plugged this same flash drive in and a picture popped up on screen for a second. Uh, and I didn't realize it when editing and my reputation is over. Um, but, you know, I'm sure it's fine. There's nothing else on screen right now that could ruin my reputation. Uh, yeah, install ThinkPad Wireless LAN. We're gonna need the, those internets. We're gonna need the interwebs. Uh, go, go. I'll restart my computer later after I give it viruses. Okay. It came with audio, okay. That's kinda, it's kinda whacked up. Uh, Intel Wireless. Okay, I think we just installed that, but... No, whatever, whatever you say, whatever you say. Yeah, uh, of course. Of course. <laughs> mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Uh, doesn't read because I'm really smart and can't read. This is simply thrilling. Ooh, Wi-Fi icon. We've got some iconography that seems to suggest we may have internet incoming. This this thing's gonna be rockin' water fox, though, because um, I like it. Move out of the way, Chrome. Move out of the way, Firefox. Water fox gang. Uh, uh-huh. Oh, I should probably not show that. Uh-huh. Yep, share everything in home group. Oh. ThinkPad X61. <laughs> That was the old install, it's gone. Fuck you. Okay, I will. Alright, now we can restart the computer. Oh, that looks like shit. It's... This background is not supposed to be anything besides, like, the blue, you know? Seeing freaking leaves on the Windows 7 logon screen has got to be one of the cursed, the most cursed images I've ever seen in my life. My profile picture is the Lenovo logo? Yuck! This is ass, dude. It's Lenovo everything here. I can't take this. This is so stupid. Why didn't I make my username valued Lenovo customer? How did the disc know it's a Lenovo? Whatever. Uh, we cannot have it be the Lenovo logo for the profile picture. So, uh, you the viewers get to decide. Vote down below. Should the profile picture be Spamton G Spamton? Or this fuck. Vote down below. Password. Okay. This is so stupid. This is so stupid like John Lupin, dude. Ugh. At least we got internet and everything. Ugh. God damn it, dude. Alright, well, you know, it's only up from here. Ooh, that looks clean. 
Wow, and just like that, we have Sony Vegas 9.0e on the ThinkPad. I, th I think it's time to stop freaking around and to actually get Steam, like it says in the title of the video that we're doing. Okay. Alright, everybody, get ready. People who clicked on the timestamp to see the part of the video that was in the title are about to show up. Everybody get on best behavior, okay? Three, two... Hello, people who went to the timestamp. Let's start installing Steam with VXKEX on Windows 7 2024 working 2024. Steam setup. Oh yeah, this is like a 2018 Steam installer. They still have downloaded from like the ancient era. Uh, yep, I'm 13 and older. Oh boy, run Steam. There's a trillion trains outside, dude. Okay. So... 140 megabytes? Are you bullshit crapping me right now? That's like a trillion bytes. Let's just get stuck here. Steam is online. You just updated. I'm assuming that means it's time for VX Kex. Uh, shit. I'm gonna get these updates off camera. I'm gonna do some. I'm gonna do some off off camera grinding real quick. Be right back. Hey guys, my off-camera grinding took so long that it's a day later, which means my freaking gag about the first computer video of the month being posted on the last day of the month is fucking ruined, um, because of fucking Windows update. It's gonna need to update more, I bet, after this. Ugh. Oh no, it needs to configure. I didn't foresee this. At least it's going quick. At least it blue screened. Oh no. Oh no. I have never had Windows 7 blue screen in an update before. Now everything is fucked. What happened? Oh no. I have not seen this in my life. Well, maybe we shouldn't have installed Sony Vegas first. If the install is just going to be uh, fricked up anyway. Maybe I shouldn't have installed like 50,000 updates without restarting. Oh, restart now to complete repairs? Don't mind if I do. And we're at normal resolution. <laughs> nice screen wobbles. What's the refresh rate, dude? Oh, fuck! I need to do it all over again, dude. Oh my god. Undid the updates. Okay, uh, at least now we can find out the hertz monitor. 60 hertz. 50 hertz? That is the same. Alright, my camera just hates existing, I guess. But... Okay, okay, okay. Oh boy, finished that one. Time to restart early. We need to get ahead of the game. That I don't have to do any updates ever again. <laughs> okay. It did not BSOD. Also known as bullshit of stupid. Which means we. And by that I mean me, because you now you've just been sitting around and watching me do this. Why haven't you helped? Time to install this update. Sure, if it doesn't frick it up again. In the meantime, use Chopper 5 to the rescue. Yeah, there he is. Uh, of course I do. This update takes forever and screen's flickering so much. <laughs> See if this works. Hey yo, DS time. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Frick yeah. Who's ready to play New Super Backrooms Bros? Let's play New Super Backrooms Bros. <laughs> Why does it look so fucking normal? Oh, oh no. <laughs> Mario, save the castle. Oh, oh no. 
Oh no, Bowser Jr. stole Princess Peach. Oh no, 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 Mario, why are you so short? Mario, you're not supposed to sit up when you're sleeping. Ugh. God, Mario's such a fucking dumbass. Okay. I'm actually a master at this game. Frick! This is the back rooms from the title. This is gonna be a Goomba. What did I say? Goomba, right there. Oh wait, it finished. Fuck new Super Backrooms Bros. I'm gonna try restarting again to see if it blue screens at the same place. Last time it blue screened at 10% configuring. Let's see what happens. I like the white text on Lenovo's shitty ass background, dude. Fuck. Lenovo. I'm getting dizzy. This screen's so wobbly. Oh shit! Oh shit! If it goes to 14%, then the percent will be the same as the age of your average Lemon Demon fan. <laughs> Wait, 30? That's not the age of your average Lemon Demon fan. That's half the age of your average Kid Rock fan. Hey, we're back and better than ever. Let's see if we can use Windows Update now. Let's see if it errors out. Or if it actually finds updates. If this video gets 2,000 views, I'll do a part two! Hey, it's updating Steam! As Windows is still checking for updates, okay. Let's, let's, let's look at this race. Who do you think will win? Vote now on your phones. Login? Steam login? I'm gonna log in screen before Windows Update is done checking. I don't think it's gonna check. I don't think it's doing anything. Uh, time to enter my login details. <laughs> Looks like it's time to enter my code. <laughs> Looks like it's waiting for network. Oh, uh, looks like Elden Ring. Red Dead Redemption 2. Fallout 76. <laughs> that game. Oh my God, are you, are you, really shitting right now? Do I even have VX Kex running? Library. Oh my fucking God. Okay. Um. All right. VX Kex is running. And it is reporting Windows 10, and it seems to be working right now. Did it finally finish checking for updates? Holy shit, it did. We're gonna have fully updated Windows 7 and Steam fun. Uh, what game should I try to install? Fallout? Sid Meier's Civilization 5. Oh, that's larger than Fallout. Survive away! Mm-hmm. Uh, yep. Let's see if it works. And uh, let's see if I can also install updates at the exact same time. Oh my god! Oh my god, It's it puts itself to sleep. So it minimizes it. Okay. Works perfectly. I'm sure if I turned going to sleep off, it'd be fine. Oh boy. 100%. Oh boy, it's installing... Uh, prerequisites. I can't wait to play my second favorite Civ game. You know, I used to be a, a certified Civ 6 hater. I really did not like Civ 6. Um, but I kind of like how they got rid of the happiness system because that was no fun. Oh my freak! Ooh, a play button. Civ 5 does not work. Uh, it doesn't open. I'm not sure why. Uh, but let's try a different game. Project Zomboid. 
This game is less 3D, you know, because 3D-ness directly impacts how how it'll work under these conditions. Oh, Windows installed new updates. Frick yeah. Whoa, that's a lot. It's also a lot of failed ones, but that's fine, I guess. Would you look at this? It's Project Zomboid. It works! We got a working game! Well, let's... Let's see if this functions. Uh... Ayo, we got a working game. Oh, that doesn't look right. Uh, yeah, but it works though. Good luck aiming. It's kind of freaked up. It must, yeah, it must be because I'm missing some of the dependencies. And it works. You can see that there's nothing in there. You can get a pen and a notebook. Write note on empty notebook. <laughs> okay, Zomboid seems to work. Um, minus the aiming. Oh, you start with a backpack and builder. You start with a Spiffo backpack and builder mode? I did not know that. Alright, turn on. Fuck Turbo. Triple N gang. Oh, Earth, Air, Wind, Fire. There's another. Ah. <laughs> uh, Nothing beats Project Zomboid TV. The forgotten element. <laughs> yep, Zomboid works. So we have one game that works and one game that does not work. So we have one game proven working, uh, but not through the Steam menu and not the 64 one. But it is playable. Um, so you can install and play games, or some games, through Steam with VX Kex, uh, but clearly not all games, and this is like obviously not the ultimate Steam experience. This is not this this is not Steam working perfectly. But uh, if you don't need to play Civ 5 ever, you probably could get by uh, if you have more stuff installed than this. Fresh Windows 7. Uh, but these two games took so long to install that I really don't feel like trying any more games. Nah, whatever. 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 Who cares? Thanks for watching the video and appreciating the screen glare. I will be back at some unspecified point with another video. It might even be as good as this one. Or better. <laughs> if I get begged to do it, I'll try more apps. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Goodbye.